The night wind howls like a wounded, dying animal. One might think the street was mourning this particular death. My dad would uh, bring me to a comic book shop. That was our Sunday ritual. We would go to Veramol when it was still Veramol and not Vimol. And there was a little comic book store called Philbars under the escalator. Siguro yung, yung earliest na memory ko ng comics is yung time na nag-uwi yung mga parents ko ng mga local siya na comic books pero about Jesus. <laughs> about Jesus Christ. Tapos so, napansin ko na yung sarili ko na binabalik-balikan ko siya palagi. Tinitignan ko na lang siya every day just for the art. As the universe seeks balance, so does the underworld. Three years later, I get a text from Kajo, 2005, and we were both working in ad agencies, working on the busiest accounts of our respective ad agencies at the time. Um, nag actually, naghahanap lang ako ng something na pwede namin gawin ng walang restrictions from bosses or walang clients. Ganun. Kasi creative rin naman yung ginagawa namin sa ad agencies eh. kami ni Budge, pero limited kami to what they want. And he texted me and said, Budge, gawa tayo ng comics. Gawa tayo ng monthly comics. Sabi ko, are you crazy? Nag-set lang ako ng goal na every lunch break, gagawa ako ng isang page. Nagawa ko yun for 20 days, natapos namin yung 20 days, yung 20 page um, script na ginawa niya. Hello, Alexandra. I had a feeling you'd want to see this for yourself. I've been trying to tell a story of this tough guy, detective person, so I thought, flip it. Instead of a guy, make him a girl. And suddenly things started to come into place. I thought she would use magic to solve crime. Um, inspired by how CSI would tell a story, but they would use science. Ano niya, yung costume niya, yung nagpop sa utak ko nung kinakreate namin yung mga, yung mga characters na yun is si Jose Rizal. Wearing that may coat, may, meron siyang photograph na naka-coat siya eh. I guess it's me trying to find answers for where did the white lady come from? Why does she only hang out in Balete Drive? Where do Tikbalangs hang out now that they're in the city? And I thought, ah, maybe they're drag racing in C5 because they love to run and they love to race. Um, where is the Nuno Sapunso now? Uh, now that you don't see, uh, you know, termite mounds so much here or there. So I thought maybe they've moved underground and they now live under manhole. So Nuno sa manhole na siya. Uh, my boss, my former boss, told me one time that, you know, I hate, I now hate parking at the basement of Mega Mall. I said, why? Because of your Chanak story about the Chanaks in the basement. So it's fun. It's fun to hear stuff like that. Frightening it may be, the stories, it suddenly makes people take a look at the city again and see and imagine something magical underneath a manhole. Fun si budget na writer. Parang pag, pag binabasa kayo mga scripts for Trese, yung imagination ko kung tumatakbo ka agad eh, kasi ang saya-saya basahin ng mga scripts. Kahit nakakatakot, kahit, kahit, kahit nagpapatayan yung mga characters dun sa page na yun. And what's great about Kajo is that he never settles. If you'll take a look at each book of Trese, his art just keeps getting better and better and better. And I write it all down on a notebook, all of the outline, the dialogue, uh, bits and pieces of the dialogue. Just when you start to hear the character say certain things, I just need to write it down. Careful where you tread. Am I a modern day myth maker? Um, I can't wait for the day when I get to read a Wikipedia entry talking about, oh, this is the legend of the Chanaks, and this is the legend of the Nuno Samano, and they'll write it as if it was an academic paper, and turns out they just heard it from someone who told someone, turns out they read it from Trece. So maybe, yes. I don't think may ginaga ako na original. Kumaga yung, yung, yung visually, yung mga nata nakikita ng tao sa page, is yung mga things na, na Nakita ko na nung bata ako or na-imagine ko na nung bata ako and then tinwist ko lang ng konti. And she utters the word that makes the heavens thunder and the word echoes across all creation. Yeah, I don't think we have an industry today 
we used to have an industry back in the 50s and 60s when comics were sold in the hundreds of thousands and reached millions out circulating newspapers. Uh, we have a very active, very uh, uh, thriving comic book scene is what we have. But until such a time when comic, when people like me can quit our day jobs and focus on doing comics and make a real living out of it, I'm not so sure we can call it an industry yet. But I think we're on our way there. Sana wag silang tumigil. Sana wag maging hobby now. Sana wag maging fun now and iiwanan ko na ito someday kasi mas may, may iba akong ipaprioritize. Sana kahit may iba silang iprioritize, hindi nila tigilan yung ito ay yung sinimula nila na creation. Comics man or, or novels. My name is Alexander Trese. I'm here as a favor for the Great Stallion, the Datu of the Tikbalang clan. I'd like to see the owner of the house.